going on gamers welcome back to another episode of do you want to win today we are going to show case my defensive scheme that i just showed you in the last video against another opponent it's always going to be a different opponent who uses different schemes and different plays if you enjoy these breakdowns go ahead take a moment drop a like right now it don't take no time but i will appreciate that very much so we setting up our audibles right now it's a couple things that you can do out of this play you gotta uh know that if you're facing a heavy blitzer they gonna do one thing and if you're facing a coverage person they gonna do another thing so i like to set my audibles so i can hurry up and audible depending on the look right now we want to take his attention away from uh what's on the field so you can see my opponent it's blitzing heavy right now. He can see that guy over there highlighted, so he's trying to cover that person. So we're gonna try to hit that corner out. So he took him away. He's moving people around. So we can hit this corner right here. He has the step on him, and we get a big yard. Now, you don't wanna just force the ball into that highlighted person. They will have somebody who was zoned out, put double coverage, triple coverage. So when they give you a free 20, 25 yards, take your 20 25 yards every single time so this opponent is real aggressive but it looks like he's playing conservative defense so what we're gonna do is we're gonna flood the middle of that field with this motion so we got the check down he has a star on this person right here so now we're gonna bring him over we got a slant and a check down so double team right there he follows him and then he leaves him and we're gonna fall down this is a three yard four yard offense but we will take what the defense gives us once he shows us that he's in like a cover two or something like he's doing right now that's when i will uh attack downfield so now we did that motion setup and now we can go either to the corner or over the top so there he is i can see the corner get over the top of him and we're gonna possession catch that we don't got enough room to swerve so now we're gonna flip it and try to run right behind him he to move people out compress them so we should be able to get a push. We just gotta find a hole. We didn't get it. We're gonna try it again. We're gonna try it again. So somebody came in was the linebacker, I think. Okay, so he's gonna uh so he's gonna leave somebody open right here. We're gonna take the matching concept away. We gotta watch this edge over here. So we're gonna ID. I want him to step out. I don't care if he leave anybody else. We're gonna bring him underneath. So nobody blitz, we're gonna hit him fast. Got the first down, so now we're gonna run the ball. Number four drop. Okay, so this is straight up the middle. We're gonna try it again. We're gonna see if he follows him all the way across the formation. The, he stays right there. So he's out wide. Let's go. Not open, I don't need to pass the ball. He went into a cover two sink where I'm gonna be able to spread you out. You're not gonna be able to compress them unless you individually move everybody and I can quick hike you. Especially being under two minutes, you only get like four and a half seconds compared to the normal full five seconds. So to the running back, so this time we gonna... Okay. Okay, so he did a... He did a delayed route. That was a good route. He did a delayed route with the uh, tight end. So he has a lot of good concepts that he's putting in there. A lot of good concepts. So we got to get that good pressure. Lawrence Taylor. Oh, good run stick. Good run stick. So this guy showed me that he will use the delay route. It's 7-7, seven, seven, two minutes and 51 seconds left. He utilized the delay route. Uh, he sent two people deep and had the running back on another route. So he's mixing in his offense really, really good on that first drive. If that safety come back down and we'll be able to hit Randy Moss over the top on this right, as long as we get the blocks. Okay, so we're going to hit him. He plays stick, so everybody dropped back right there. I wasn't able to get over the top of that cover three because he had it to the opposite side. So his corner is on that left side, so we're going to flip the play. If we can catch him in that again, we're going to flip the play 
and run it to the opposite side. That'll be the weak side of the defense. Let's go. We can't take no big hits. Now we on the left hash mark. The clock is running, and he went into cover two. So now that he went into cover two, we can put us a corner route on the sideline. And he's making adjustments right now. So he might be bringing that guy over there. So we got a corner and then a tight end behind it. So there's the corner over the top. Got to get over the top. Catch that. That's a touchdown. Let's go. Let's go. You either got to follow that tight end down the seams or you got to follow that corner route. Since I had the tight end going down the seam, plus I streaked on the outside of that three steps, he didn't have no choice but to pause, and then I was able to get over the top of his cloud. So now we got to get on defense and we got to strap up. We can't let him burn the whole minute and 27 seconds and then let him score a touchdown also. We got to be able to limit him to either three or cause a turnover. So he, so he's in love with this uh, package right here. So this time we're going to bluff him. We're going to bluff him this time. Got to put that pressure on him. Let's go. Perfect defense. Come on. You got to come with that pick. So he was expecting for the pressure to come. We bluffed him. So this time he might run it. Single back. So we need more people in the run fits right here. More people in the run fit. Somebody got to break through. Let's go. Let's go. Let that clock tick. Just in case he get a big game. Third and 15. Back against the wall right now. So we're going to hit him with a cover two this time. He probably going to throw it to them outsides. This is when we're going to mix in that cover two. Going to bluff this play. And I'm going to use him. Let's go, Dion. You're supposed to jump that for me. Pump me my rock. We got him in the perfect situation, fourth and 15. Now, it's a chance that he might have a, he's doing double flex. So we're going to have to hit him with. Uh, we're going to put us a spy out there, too. We're going to watch them out routes. Got to watch them out routes. That's two people back there. I ain't worried about it. I ain't worried about it. Stay on your feet. We need to pick up some yards. Ah, come on. So we got two timeouts. And my opponent pulls the cord. That's what I mean by adjustments. You see he was able to hit me when I was in man coverage. Hitting me with corner routes. Good runs was setting up for his big drives. But I played conservative the whole time, and then I made him make a mistake. He was having long drives. He didn't like that, and we walked away victorious. Drop a like. I'll see y'all on the next video. Let's go.